Hello everyone, welcome to Rasa's Classroom. Today we are solve a interesting mass Olympiad question. It is an easy mass problem, which is x plus y is equal to 6, x y is equal to 6, and we are find out x y is equal to what, how to solve this interesting mass Olympiad question. This is our first equation and this is our second equation. So first of all, I take our first equation, our math solution, which is x plus y is equal to 6. Now you can see really here is y is equal to 6. And if I move on this x in this side, it will be negative x. So we'll find out y is equal to 6 minus x. This is our third equation. Now at this moment, I take our second equation, which is x, y is equal to 6. But remember that or recall y is equal to 6 minus x. So it will be x times 6 minus x is equal to 6. Now 6 times x it will be 6x and x times x it will be x squared is equal to 6. Then you can see that it will be negative x squared. Then this is positive 6x. And if I move on this 6 in this side, it will be negative x is equal to 0. Now, in this quadratic equation, I take negative sign is common. So this quadratic equation, it will be x squared minus 6x plus 6 is equal to 0. I multiply both sides negative sign. Then it is a nice quadratic equation. And you can see that here is a is equal to 1 b is equal to negative 6 and c is equal to 6 so you can say it is x it will be minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4 a c over 2 a now if i apply this mass formula you can see really minus b b is minus 6 plus minus square root v square i mean minus 6 whole square minus 4 ac a is 1 and c is 6 over 2a a is 1 now here is x it will be minus minus plus 6 plus or minus square root minus 6 whole square it is positive below because of that power is even number so it will be 36 minus 4 times 6 it will be 24 over 2 times 1 it will be 2 now 6 plus or minus square root 36 minus 24 it will be 12 over 2. now if i evaluate this square root so it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root 12 it will be 4 times 3 over 2. now here 6 plus or minus square root 4 it will be 2 square root 3 it will be square root 3 over 2 two now at this moment if i separate this fraction you can see really here x is equal to here is 2 is common so if i take 2 is common 6 divided 2 it will be 3 plus or minus 2 divided 2 it will be 1 here is square root 3 over 2 these two these two cancel out we are find out here is x is equal to 3 plus minus square root 3 both are here is positive value and both are real solution here is no complex number both are real solution now we are find out here is x1 it will be 3 plus square root 3 and x2 is equal to 3 minus square root 3 but y is equal to what but remember that or recall our third equation y is equal to 6 minus x so you can see really here y is equal to 6 minus x y is equal to 6 minus x now here 6 minus x x which is 3 plus square root 3 and y2 here is 6 minus x x it will be 3 minus square root 3 here then it will be 6 minus 3 minus square root 3 plus or minus it will be minus then here 6 minus 3 minus minus it will be plus 3 square root 3 then you can see really 6 minus 3 it will be 3 then here is minus square root 3 then it will be 3 plus square root 3 so we are find out our final solution which is x comma y 
when x is equal to 3 plus square root 3 this time y is equal to 3 minus square root 3 when x is equal to 3 minus square root 3 this time y is equal to 3 plus square root 3 let's verify this is our final solution in this exponent in this mass problem so let's verify our question x plus y is equal to 6 and x y is equal to 6 this is our question so first of all we are verified this equation so it will be x plus y x which is 3 plus 3 then y it will be 3 minus square root 3 this is square root 3 so this this cancel out you can see really 3 plus 3 it will be 6 so we are find out left hand side and right hand side both side is equal and x y is equal to 6 is it right let's verify which is x is equal to 3 plus square root 3 times and y is equal to 3 minus square root 3 now according to this identity we know that a plus b times a minus b which is a square minus b square so if i apply this mass formula so i can see easily here is a is equal to 3 and v is equal to square root 3 now if i apply this mass formula here so it will be a square i mean 3 square minus square root 3 bracket power is 2 now at this moment 3 to the power 2 it will be 9 minus then square root is cancel it will be 3 so you can see easily 9 minus 3 it will be 6 so left hand side and right hand side both set is equal so you can see easily x y is equal to this and this this and this this is our final answer in this math problem thank you all if you enjoyed this math question please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care everyone